What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I want to talk about advanced accounting. Uh, last week we did introduce uh, accounting. Um, we want to divorce uh, QuickBooks all the way, so let's mine as well, let's just do it professionally. Um, uh, there's a couple things that we missed. We added those number one uh, uh, category. Um, we need to know the class, which class uh, the expense belong to. Uh, is it utilities? Is it rent or mortgage? So whatever uh, the language of IRS uh, understand. Uh, number two, adding daily expense. That's something really important. Uh, if you went and got a lunch for the mechanics and you want to add that expense, uh, you can add it daily. So that way at the end of the day, you're going to have your uh, <coughs> shop expenses and we're gonna take the expenses from your profit. So it's gonna be more detailed, uh, more professional. Let's check it out. So let's first of all, uh, let's talk about your daily expense. Uh, when you click to add a daily expense, uh, just click on view and then add an expense. Uh, it's gonna list all your expenses for the day. Assume that, you know, your brake cleaner, uh, we have the category and you can put it under shop, uh, supplies and material and how did you pay for it. Uh, card and all that. I say we get a lunch. We get, remember, all this stuff are uh, tag are uh, deductible. So keep that in mind. So let's say we get a food. Say food. Lunch. I mean, this description is going to be more for you, but we still have uh, we still have to select one of these right here. We're going to go to meals and entertainment. Uh, let's say we paid $45 <clears throat> we paid cash for it and we click on add can you add the day before yes you can can you add uh, the day after yes you can so you're in control this is a daily expenses and these expenses will automatically populate it in your monthly expenses in your balance sheet and keep in mind, um, try to keep your uh, the same words because uh, VIP will, let's say you bought gloves, uh, keep adding the same word because <laughs> your yearly expenses are gonna be all combined with one. So gloves, instead of saying too many gloves, 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 it'll be one gloves and uh, we'll give you the total. But our goal, we wanna make sure that we'll print uh, according to that category. Uh, meaning starting from uh, your rent um, to software and subscription services um, to utilities. So utilities is going to be your water bill, your electric bill. Let me give you just 101 uh, <laughs> IRS taxes or accounting. So utilities is going to be your uh, your water bill, your gas bill, uh, um, your, uh, your electric bill, uh, travel and expenses if you went somewhere. Um, transportation if you have a car and you you're, you're deducting your the gas mileage or whatever um, the taxes anything under taxes goes there from your payroll taxes to your sales tax so you need to classify all these and we made it simple we get all these uh, terms that the IRS use um, so you can use them it's gonna make your life easier at the end of the year to file for taxes or it's gonna make uh, the, your accountant um, uh, life a lot easier too but you gotta keep track with that um, uh, so that that's gonna be uh, your daily expenses like I said just to do it um, just to add an expense just click on add an expense and classify uh, the, what type of what type of expense is it and how did you pay for it um, uh, when you go to your balance sheet so this is how your balance sheet is going to be. If the first thing you need to do, um, you need to go back to your monthly expenses and you need to fix, um, uh, not fix, update. So uh, basically rent, just make sure it goes under rent. Uh, make sure your uh, phone bill goes under you, your utilities and, um, and all that. So you can need to organize that once you do that. Remember, we still have the auto populate, which is the best thing ever. I'm um, just clicking auto populate and it fills it automatically. That's for May 2021. Um, um, for your sales tax, for example, you see it's under taxes. If I click on it, obviously, there's no sales tax for this month. So, 
um, you still can add expenses from here like I said um, uh, with the payment type and everything so our goal is eventually after when it's ready when you go to your daily report um, you're gonna have shop expenses and we're gonna take that amount so from every day we're gonna take the expenses out and we're gonna give you your total net profit um, uh, so that's pretty cool might as well we do it the right way um, so we don't have to uh, rely on Excel sheet for the people who still using Excel sheet and hanging in there <laughs> it, like I, I didn't know Excel sheet was invented in 1979 literally uh, or in the 70s I don't know maybe even before so yeah uh, VIP shop management is gonna do all your accounting in the simplest uh, possible way and uh, in a way that we all can understand it uh, taxes is not going anywhere so might as well let's all learn it um, uh, let's understand uh, our tax uh, de deductible um, this is the stuff that's very important and um, that's it for today I appreciate you guys watching until next time thanks